Hi all, uh, welcome to the series of intro questions front end every day. Let's see question 45 of this series. So what is common JS module? This is one of the oldest module, okay, in JavaScript. It is a native module of Node.js. If you uh, work with Node.js, this is the native module. It is a module on which the uh, entire NPM ecosystem is built, okay. Uh, it uses as you know it uses require and module.export require for uh, importing and for exporting you can use module.exports uh, or export both can be used maybe module.export for uh, exporting a single value and exports for uh, importing multiple values and if you take a node uh, common js right uh, if you uh, use common js that is if you use require the modules are loaded synchronously you have to understand it is loaded synchronously so it waits for the module to be loaded before it goes to the next line so it is more preferred for backend not for front end okay so uh, as you see here uh, for exporting we use exports dot uppercase and for importing we use require okay you we use require okay and we can use that uppercase module dot uppercase for uh, using that function from that module. This is one of the thing. And another uh, important thing is the modules cannot be analyzed statically. You can't the bundlers like Webpack or uh, Rollup cannot analyze this modules common JS module statically. That is at build time. This cannot be analyzed and tree shaking cannot be performed on them okay the bundlers cannot uh, re uh, reduce the unused code okay remove the unused uh, unused or dead code because at build time they cannot come to know the modules the things which are exported at build time from that module common js module they cannot uh, come to know in build time what are the things which are exported from that module only at runtime in the browser context only they will come to know so the the bundlers cannot do tree shaking on these modules okay so uh, the common js bundle bundle is supposed to be larger than es modules es modules because tree shaking cannot be done okay so uh, ES modules are more preferred than common JS modules okay and uh, just to repeat it is more suitable for server side this is not suitable for front end because the modules are loaded synchronously so the the users may see a great time there if uh, it loads synchronously okay and if load synchronously what will happen is the the user may see the screen freeze for some time so all these issues may happen so it is most suitable for server side yes hope uh, this is clear thank you guys